So yeah, how about that 2020? 2020 has been rocking, boy, I'm telling you. I'm not even gonna lie to you. 2020 has been my favorite year by far. And if you cannot tell the sarcasm in my voice, then either you cannot speak English very well or you suck because 2020 has been sucking the entire time. I'm pretty sure that you feel it wherever you are too. I'm pretty sure you do. Jesus, man. I'm not gonna lie. And I'm not gonna say that I've been going through the hardest things ever or it's been the hardest year in the world ever, but I mean, it's crazy how you don't realize those good things that you have while you have them. There's so many quotes that say that anyway. I should already know that. Soul Fam is your boy Chris with Soldier of Life and today I have no shirt on because why not because I'm down for the flex I like to get my flex on I work hard for this you know what I'm saying but today we are getting ready for the very last day that we can go to the gym this is because of the new lockdown that's gonna be going on in Germany it's like lockdown 2.0 or whatever it is so everything will be closed that isn't school or work related I think something like that but to, it's the last day to get it in Usually I don't go on Sundays, but we got to get it in today. So we're going to go do that. I was trying to get big and bulk during the winter holidays because you know you want to get big and fluffy. I know I did big and fluffy like a bear and then I could slim it down during the summer. But because of this, I guess we're just going to have to slim it down a little bit early. So after today, I will be working on slimming my body down, getting it all cut and good stuff like that. So with Sweet Sorrow, this is our last day in the gym, but hopefully we can crush it and have a good day today. So what is up, Soul Fam? This is your boy, Editing Chris. <laughs> Bet you wasn't expecting to see me right now. But basically what I wanted to start doing in these videos is I wanted to be showing more of my life. I mean, this is my lifestyle. And you know, trying to admit a lot of these things, it makes no sense to me. Plus I think this is good stuff. So then you can get to see where my head is at when I'm doing this. But really on this last workout day for Germany, for being in the gym, the one thing I wanted to concentrate on was actually getting my max reps that I did before. Now I've only done um, three plates on each side. I don't even know how much weight that is, I forgot. But I've only done it um, one, like one and a half times. And this is a part of my journey that I remember vividly. And I remember this time where I was actually streaming. I was live streaming on Twitch and it was the last day that I live stream and I told myself, I told the one, I think it was two, I had two viewers at the time in there and the one viewer that was in there, he basically motivated me to do the three stacks on each side. And this was a huge moment that I realized, you know, like doing this, having somebody to push me having somebody that can share this moment with me was the reason why I started doing social media in the first place. And that's another thing that I wanted to remind myself every day when I forget. I forget why I do this sometimes. I forget why I make videos or why I even think about trying to do this as a profession. Is because those moments and having those people that can share that with me is, I believe, monumental to my own personal success. You know, and hopefully I can do the same thing or motivate somebody else in the same token. And that's really what I wanted to get on when doing this. So that's it. I just wanted to show this um, here in this video. I had to have my girlfriend help me do the weight because, you know, I usually go to gym alone, so I don't have a spotter. And the one day that I can't lift this up or something happens to my arm, it's going to crush and fall on my neck. So I went ahead and I attempted this, but she's not really like, you know, with the spotting, it's like, 
you know, I was always thinking about making a gym etiquette video, but she spotted me. But the thing on the first attempt is that she had her hand on the bar the whole entire time. And I know how that is. It's like, you feel like you're not really helping them with that little bit, that little pull that they get. It's like way too much help. So I did it again and I wanted to make sure she didn't touch it at least for just for the first one to make sure that I can get this and you can see as soon as I started struggling she pulled it up because obviously she doesn't want the weight to crush her BF's neck so still give it a shout out for her for helping me with that but today that day was chest day and I made sure to get it in as good as I can um, um, right now I just want to be in the best shape that I have ever been in in my life you know that is my new goal for 20 20, 2021 and probably pushing into 2022. I want to continue this effort not just because I you know am a bigger person I guess I don't even feel big but I want to document that journey also every single day you know pumping it out grinding so you can see continuously what you can do to change your body. I mean I'm really elemental on that so that's all I got for this. Make sure you continue to enjoy the rest of the video. this lens we have this lens right here that I always keep on this camera but I don't want to always take the camera with me the extra camera and I want it on this lens wait and this lens here but I want it on this camera and this camera's a Lumix this comes off of a, this is the uh, kit uh, lens for my Canon camera that I got years ago and I don't really use this lens anymore but I figure because I have this uh, Lumix setup um, with the Canon lens right here, my vlogging lens, I wanted to put this one there. This is dope for B-roll. And the problem is it's an APS-C sensor, so it has this little buffy thing right here. Like it has this little, can you see? As like this little notch right here and I'm trying to get rid of that so I can use it on my camera so I can use it on the camera that I have here so today we're gonna task uh, somebody out with doing this and see if they can do it right I hope so because it's important and I don't want to have to buy this again so yeah let's Today was a very cool day at the gym. I'm very glad that I went on the last day. It's gonna be open now It should be closed for about a month. So instead of doing gym work, we're gonna be doing like band work We ordered some bands from Amazon. So I'm gonna be using that for the entire month Hopefully I can like cut it all up and you know, I'll lose a little bit of weight um, finally cut this down if you see right here the This thing yeah, 
this thing. We cut, or I cut the top off right here. So then I can put it on this camera setup and I don't have to swap it out because I have the, um, what is the thing called? Because I have the lens mount adapter on here, the 0.81 adapter, the Viltrox adapter, I cannot, I couldn't use this on here before. I had to swap everything in order to put this lens on, but now that I cut that piece off, I can just swap this lens right here. So it's gonna be very good for like making videos every single day. So that was a good thing. But I did have to order one of these, a um, UV filter, because years ago when I used this camera when I was vlogging, some drunk guy knocked my camera down and broke it. So I had to take the glass out of here. So there's like nothing, there's no protective thing, glass on top of this lens. So I wanna get a filter on it so I can't scratch and stuff like that. But yeah, we're gonna go down to the studio and try to get ready for the rest of the week. Now, Right now, recently, you know, I don't know if it's just me. It's always me. It's definitely me. It's like a hundred percent me. But been going through like this, this, this weather thing's coming back. This, this, was it quarantine? Not quarantine, but this lockdown thing is coming back, and it's crazy, and it's putting a huge strain on me. It's always been straining a little bit, but I didn't really realize what I was doing totally wrong here like absolutely wrong now i know for one thing the lockdown has definitely got me stressed out but that is not it that's not it at all and like recently i don't even know who i am like i've been losing myself yo like i don't i'm not here like my face is here like my face is right here but i'm like that way or that way or that way i don't know where i am so recently just doing some self-reflection some life reflection even on this youtube stuff my whole platform all that good stuff everything in totality all of social media has just been driving me crazy the elections coming up america's going crazy and i really think for myself you know doing videos doing things like this i mean just life general this is how life is now you know what i'm saying and a lot of people won't really know how that how that is if they're really just going about their day every day and not really thinking about the outside world but you know as a person creating content thinking constantly about what's going on and how to do this better and what distance and that i drove myself crazy and having this talk with a friend of mine i'm actually realizing the one element that i've totally missed out on this total process like this total process the whole thing just recently, I made a video about the thousand day challenge that I want to do for myself. Now, what this really entails, you know, for my big grand scheme things, you know, I want to say about two, three years down the road, down the line, this will be a whole product like this, right? Like this is going to be something totally like you remember it right now. This is going to be, you know what I'm saying? And I wanted to concentrate that product on one simple thing, one thing only so I can really harness that and really become the commander, the chef, if you will, of that niche. And I really, I wanted to bring it down into is focus. Now I have not been focusing like I'm supposed to in a long time. And there's 35 different reasons why, like so many different reasons, but it's really because everything is commanding attention. You know what I'm saying? Like, I want to make videos for you guys, but also I want to make videos that make me happy. I also want to make sure that I'm doing well for my family. I also want to make sure that I'm taking care of the people in America that I didn't leave behind. But you know what I'm saying? Like my family over there, there's a lot of things going on. I want to make sure I scroll when I wake up in the morning. I want to make sure that I do Germany justice. I want to be an American German rapping something rapper guy you know what i'm saying i want to do 45 different things but when you're trying to do so many things at one time you cannot focus on the things that really matter so what i did is made this thousand day thing and it's really to start focusing on what do i really what, what is my dream life and can i get that within a thousand days and really the days are going to go by anyway you know what I mean? You might as well be doing something that you want to do. So I decided to take this, take this challenge that I created for myself and put it into something that I can maybe create a product for everybody else to use. So the one big thing that I've been missing since 
being like an American living here in Germany, I forgot why I came here. You know what I mean? I kind of started letting that the the work aspect and all this other stuff that I could have done in America. Why am I specifically here in Germany? Why? Is because of my thought process, how I think. But at the end of the day, it's because I had more fun here. I enjoyed myself. I felt better. I was out doing things that I wanted to do. And I, I, I can't explain it. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm going to probably say, you know what I'm saying a lot because I'm not going to edit this. But I, I haven't been fulfilling myself like I was two years ago when I first got here. And that's been my huge problem for forever. Like man forever like i'm i want i want every video to be perfect i want this to be like this i want that to have this and i want it to be like this and are people gonna like it and da, 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 da. i forgot to have fun i forgot and just recently i've gone to this you know uh thing for kids like this little playground play area and i was going to make this video about why you should be having fun every day like have fun every single day <laughs> Right now we're looking for the kid. We're trying to pin her. Where is she? Is she up? I'm gonna go the other way. Uh, uh, what the? What's going on? How do I get up here? That's not up. There she is. There she is. There she is. Here's the ass. Where did she go? Get him over. <laughs> I can't find her. <laughs> We're trying to pin her, but I can't find her. Man. <laughs> Where'd she go? That's heavy. <laughs> and I totally forgot. Like after these moments, I totally forgot. And then just sitting back, contemplating about life and all this other stuff the people the reason that a lot of people miss out on 
the the restaurants when things are locked down and all this stuff because they don't have fun every day they don't a lot of people do not have fun every day and that was one quality one aspect that i was very good at like i would enjoy myself every single day i don't care about a lockdown i just want the gym don't get me wrong i want the gym let me get my gains i want the gym but i don't really care about a lockdown i don't care to go to a restaurant or to go get my hair cut because i don't have hair anyway i don't really care to do any of that stuff i i gotta go to school like school's not locked down i wish it was but i gotta go to school to learn german but the lockdown doesn't affect me that much because i used to enjoy myself every day like i had prided myself on being able to have fun without the 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 outer aspects of other people especially here in germany so that's what i really wanted to say in this video oh plus you know every video i gotta jump back on this daily thing but every video from now on i will be speaking a little bit of german because weil is sehr weil weil sehr richtig ist Ich werde schon. No, ich soll schon Deutsch sprechen, aber ich kann nicht und muss üben jeden Tag, weil ich werde gern ein Deutschmensch. <laughs> yeah, whatever. You know, I'm just joking. But I need to practice German every day. And the one thing that I was gonna say also in another video, and I recorded this stuff, but I never made it, is for me, for learning German, listen, I'm gonna mess it up, like a lot. I'm gonna mess up German a whole lot. But for me, that's the only way I'm gonna learn. The one thing I will say is that a lot of German people, when you're learning German, they'll tell you how wrong a German is. I don't care. I'm gonna say it, and I'm gonna mess it up a lot. And if you wanna correct me, that's awesome. It would be helpful if you positively correct me, maybe help me learn how to learn it better. But if not, whatever, just correct me and just tell me I'm wrong and I'm gonna keep saying it anyway. I'll probably just keep saying it wrong until it clicks in my head that some way is right, but I'm gonna probably continue to say it wrong anyway. So I feel so much better getting off my chest. Thank you. Thank you for letting me do this. Thank you for letting me fit. But that's all I got for you guys today. I cannot believe the gym is locked down. Today was the last day to go to the gym. It's done, son. Now I got to work out on my own with no weights and no place to go. <laughs> okay, I'm better. Okay. Yeah, that's all I got for you guys today. You're beautiful. You're amazing. I love you. Chris, Soldier of Life.